Hello everyone, my name is Andira Yusuf Kara. I'm originally from Sudan, but I live in Kenya as a refugee. Andira is an experienced researcher and also an advocate. I've worked with my community refugees in urban areas, but also in the camp setting. I've also worked with other international organizations and aid organizations, including the African Union. I like to describe myself simply as a proactive refugee young woman who loves to work with her community to make it a better place. Well, as I reflect today, uh, I would like to start with a little bit of background. Uh, with UNHCR, or according to UNHCR data, we see that Africa represents almost a third of world's refugees. And most of these refugees uh, live in East Africa to be particular. Unfortunately, most of these African states have uphold very restrictive um, policies towards refugee hosting. And Kenya has uh, been hosting protected refugees since the 90s, which means refugees have been hosted in Kenya since the 90s without a proper solutions to them 30 years later. Most of these refugees are young people who have fled various atrocities and are looking forward to brighter future. And in Kenya, to be particular, refugees live in two large camps, namely Dadaab Refugee Camp and Kakuma Refugee Camp. With lots of challenges facing these young refugees, um, the re young refugees are the most resilient and determined young Africans. Um, they have come up with lots of um, excel or that have excelled in various ways, including education and find um, pathways to economic resilience, such as starting um, businesses. Some even have started refugee-led initiatives and organizations that have continuously support their community. As a young refugee woman, I would like to totally uphold and recognize the resilience and determination of young refugee women in their various community. As a young refugee woman, I totally recognize um, all the resilience that we've uphold all these years. Safety for us is very key and we can't wait to experience Africa that is able to make meaningful steps uh, to be able to move from not just celebrating resilience but to make concrete steps in policy changes and meaningful participation and inclusion of young people. Let's walk the talk and help whoever, wherever and whenever to be safe in this co beautiful continent of ours. On this day, I celebrate every young refugee and particularly young refugee women. Thank you.